Yes, people, welcome back to another content. John Sinclair TV back again to do a quick match preview a game between Newcastle United and Liverpool at St James's Park. Kick off 12.30 on this glorious sunshine city of Newcastle. And this is going to be a tough game, I can't lie. But if we're going to have a win the game or have a real goal, then we have cannot give Liverpool too much respect. This is going to be a tough game. I can't lie. Yeah, I get it. But people say this is going to be a free hit. People say we've got to have a real goal to persevere our top 10 position at some time with ninth. <clears throat> Excuse me. And this is going to be one hell of a game. I really feel I can feel the passion. I can feel the, the heat as well. And this is going to be a cracking, cracking game. But if you look at the Newcastle players who's going to play, it's going to be, I make a one change, I drop Murphy, I bring him back, Miggy Amiron, yeah, and keep it the same lineup. And oh, Joe Willock can drop as well and bring back John Joe Shelby. And I will have a 4 3 3, the back and goal, right back craft, opposite side, I will say target, the two centre backs, Burn and Shear. Midfield three will be Shelby, Joel and Bruno. And the front three will be ASM, Miggy, and Chris Wood, and that's going to be our 11, going to start the game against Liverpool. Now, if we are going to win the game, and it's a big, big gift, we have got to stay with them and don't give them any time on the ball. We've got to press them. We have just got to do something about it very quickly, yeah? We just cannot give Liverpool too much respect. Yes, they're a world-class team. Yes, they're unstoppable. And yes, their fun three is absolutely tasty. However, we have got to concentrate for the whole 90 minutes. And if we do concentrate for the whole 90 minutes, we can get someone out of this game. That is a big if. If we allow Liverpool to take the game and let them do what they want to do, we are going to get punished, yeah? Emil Kraft, yes, he had three great games. He's got to do it again. He has got to concentrate on Luis Diaz if he does play it or Sadio Mane, yeah? Getting close to them. Don't give them an ounce of space. The same with Target. Yes, again, decent. This is a test for him. It's all okay clear doing it against the likes of Norwich and doing it against Wolves and doing it against Leicester. But Liverpool is a different animal altogether. Yeah? He's got to keep tight on Moore Salah. Keep those quiet. We could win the game or get something out of the game. If we don't, then they're going to rip us apart. And that's exactly what you do not want at St. James Park. The atmosphere is going to be electric. The war flags are on force as well. I'm going to have my breakfast as well and meet the guys as well. So if you do watch the video, I'll be outside the stadium opposite the strawberry. We'll have a good natter as well. And yeah, my prediction, I'm going to, my heart's going to say um, ones each. But my head, I'd hate to say this, I think Liverpool's going to win this. We're going to go goal up half time. Liverpool could going to come back in the second half. But as long as you give them all. In fact, I want to see Liverpool players collapse after 90 minutes, or after the final whistle. And that tell me that we gave them a hell of a game. I want to come out of the stadium and say, we gave them a heck of a game. We gave them a hard game. And if you give it a go, we'll pierce you. And then hopefully we could go on to the next season. If we win this game and Eddie Howe's stock will be so high, it'll be absolutely unreal. Unreal. So, guys, tell us what you think. If you leave a comment section down below, and also please hit the like button, hit also subscribe to my channel, John Sinclair TV, and tell us your prediction as well. What's going to happen today's game between Newcastle United and Liverpool? And a wheeler, lads!